Well, there is one state employee I'd like to see laid off, and that's Scott Walker. Because this is just lies. It's lies about the money. You know, it's like the magician that does something with one hand to try to take your eye away from the manipulation that's going on under the cloth. He wants people to be thinking of that the problem is state employees or public employees rather than the tax cuts that he just made to the cronies who backed him. And, you know, this, this isn't about money. It's about power. Because the public employees unions have said, we'll be glad to negotiate cutbacks. We've already taken them. We'll take more. So don't take away our collective bargaining rights. That's what this is really about. This is about crushing the state unions, the public employee unions, so that they can go after the private sector unions. It's just like what Harley Davidson did. They held a gun to people's head and they said, look, this is your choice. You either accept a second tier wage force will we'll get a lot less money and have no job security and no benefits and can work whenever we want them to, or we'll move the plant. You know, your, your, your money or your jobs altogether. That's a completely untenable choice. And people are being given the same choice now. Rather than seeing what public employees have bargained for as a model, good for you, let's see how we can do this for all workers so we can have a non-poverty, so that employment can be a way out of poverty and not another form of it. They want to say, let's compare them to the lowest, to the least, to the least powerful, and so that you will forget about the ones who've been ripping us all off at the top. 